When you want to learn more about the bacteria or prokaryotic cell, we are presented always with two-dimensional images like this, which doesn't give a complete idea about the structure of the bacterial cell. But wait, the amazing new technology called augmented reality will help us to visualize the structure in 3D and that too on the smartphone that you're holding right in your hand with the help of Google app. So let's see how we can do it. Hey, hello everyone. This is Vishal Boyer. Welcome to the YouTube channel where we will help you to learn in a very simple and effective way. That is the bio way. So here I am in the Google app. If you have not installed this app, then I would recommend you to install it from the Play Store or the App Store. So let's see the next step. In the Google app, search bacteria and scroll and look for this one where it will be showing you the 3D model. Then click the button to view in 3D. You will be presented with two options. View the model in AR and in 3D. You can see I can interact with this model of bacteria very easily and efficiently. 3D models are available for nearly all smartphones. But let me tell you first to view the given model in augmented reality, your smartphone must be AR core compatible in the case of Android phones. I will give a link in the description containing the list of Android devices having AR enabled in them. You can check yourself to see if your Android phone is AR core enabled or not. In the case of iPhones, you can experience AR on iPhone 6s and higher models. So let us see now how we can study the bacteria in AR itself. Now let us select the AR option. Now as soon as you click it, you can see now the cell is visible in front of you and you can see the entire cell, the bacterial cell over here. You can actually use your fingers and you can rotate the entire structure. You can see how the structure is visible over here. Here it's a, it is a flagella or flagellum and you can see you can rotate the structure. You can zoom in and out so you can make it bigger or smaller with using your pinch to zoom with your finger. Then here you can see I'm rotating the structure and making it more smaller so that you can uh, visualize the entire bacterial cell or the prokaryotic cell. Now, let us see the different types of organelles and the structural features of bacterial cell. And we will study with the help of obviously augmented reality. So we are, we are observing here the plasma membrane and cell wall. You can see plasma membrane is in dark green color and cell wall is in uh, light blue color. And then there is a capsule which is in light green color. Then these are the fimbriae. You can see numerous fimbriae all over the cell. And this is the green color long extended is a flagellum organelle present. And you can see uh, the flagellum is connected and it is having the arrangement of motor protein which helps the flagella to rotate itself so that bacteria can move. I have made many videos on each of these organelles. I will give the link in the description below. Let us see the next one. Let us see the nucleoid, which is nothing but the chromosome, the DNA, the genetic material of the bacteria. You can see the plasmid over here, small extra chromosomal circular DNA structure. You can see ribosomes suspended in the cytoplasm over here. And you can see the rest of the structure like plasma membrane, cell wall and capsule. Now, what we will do is like, we will rotate the cell a little bit. Now we are looking at the pillars of the bacteria. You can see the little long pillars. Over here also you can see. We can increase the size of the cell. Yes, this particular model we can increase and we can make it bigger. And the fantastic part starts now because when you increase in it like when it when you increase the size of the cell you can directly get into the cytoplasm so this is quite beautiful 
we can actually see the cell from within you can see we have entered the cell you can see this is quite interesting we will get through the cell like in this manner you can see the cytoplasm is visible with the nucleoid with the dna of that bacteria and this seems to be fantastic to view through that cell so this is the way this is the awesome way that you can use augmented reality to study the bacterial structure or the prokaryotic cell structure you can see the motor protein beautiful over here which is the flagellar motor which helps the flagella to rotate and move and help in the movement of the cell the bacterial cell so here you can see how beautifully we can incorporate the use of augmented reality in education the example that we have seen today is of using it to study the prokaryotic cell structure and even teaching this to the student in a more interactive engaging way i have made many videos on prokaryotic cell structure link for the entire playlist i am giving in the card above and also in the description below if you want me to make a video on study of eukaryotic cell in augmented reality then kindly let me know in the comment section below if you found this video useful then give it a like hit the bell icon to get new upcoming videos on use of augmented reality in education bye bye subscribe to my youtube channel the bioway on youtube and press the bell icon so that you will never miss another update from my channel thank you